Yo, what's going on YouTube? Welcome back to the video blog one more time. Hoxton Trent. Guys, as I said I would do, man, I'm going to review all this stuff that I bought from this really cool looking shop called The Idle Man. What I did is I bought a whole bunch of jumpers on there and I jumped onto the website and I do recommend you jump onto the website. It's called The Idle Man. Um, and it's not really big boy designer brands, but what it was is when I went to um, Hamburg, I found a brand that I really liked. It was called Selected Hom, and I bought it. If you saw the street tour video in Hamburg, you would have seen it was part two of the street tours um, blog. I bought a jumper from a shop. It was called Selected Hom, and I really liked the brand a lot. It was the first time I got it in, and it was something like 50 euros. So I really liked it. So obviously, when I jumped back to London, I thought, let me find out if there was a place that sold this top, because I thought it was really good especially for 50 euros. And again, I came across the Idle Man, which is right here, and there it had a huge sale on, man. So I picked up all types of jumpers for like 30 quid. So I thought, you know what, let me get them in, let me review them. And I got, I got this stuff in like about two weeks ago, guys, and I haven't even opened the box. The box is right here, and I said, I'm gonna open it when I, as soon as I see you guys. I said, as soon as I see you guys, I'm gonna open the box and we're gonna go through all the items together, okay? So guys, I'm gonna go through that real quick. Um, also, I want to let you know that I'm going to Portsmouth as well tomorrow. I'm going to be doing a street tours video down there. There's an outlet. It was one of the, it was one of the um, Snapchat subscribers that actually said, "Oh, mate, you should come down to Portsmouth. There's a retail outlet down there." And I thought, you know what? Let me just go down there and see what it's saying. It's meant to be like Bista Village, so I'm going to go down there. And oh yeah, Bista Village is coming soon, guys. Just need a bit of time to prep that up, but I will be going down there. The other thing is on Thursday, I'm going down to Amsterdam, so that's going to be really cool. There's going to be a street tours coming down there. One of my mates is dancing down there. He's like a dancer. He does like street dancing, beatbox dancing, all this type of stuff. So I'm going to go down there. We're going to hang out, check out some stores. Apparently, they've got a Montclair store down there I saw online, and they've got a Stone Island store. But I'm going to be going all around there, checking out the sites and seeing what everything's saying, okay? So that's that, guys, man. Let me just prep myself up for this review. Bam! Two seconds. Yo, what's popping, guys? Got all the stuff on the bed now, so let's see what it's real. All this stuff is saying, guys. Bam! Been a long time since you see Mr. Hacksaw. He's been away. He's come back now. He's ready for some unboxing. So he's all blessed. So as I said, jumped over to this place called the Idle Man. I believe they've got a store, and it's somewhere in North London. I think it's around Angel kind of Islington area. What I'm going to do actually, I'm going to jump down to the store and go and check it out because it looks really, really cool. And I was really feeling some of the prices that were on there online on the website. A lot of people, as the channel is growing now and I started off doing designers, and to be honest with you, I think I'll always keep doing high-end to mid-end designer reviews, but so many people asking me saying, Hoxton, I don't have three bills, I don't have two bills, I've got one bill and that's it and I need to get some clothes and I totally get that man I totally understand when I first started um, collecting clothing I didn't have big boy cheese so I just had to make do with what I got which is why I started buying a lot of stuff on eBay and I started buying a lot of like cheaper brands and stuff like that so I wasn't even I wasn't buying I wasn't always buying Montclair and Stone Island so I, I totally get that man for some of you that are just starting out but that's that so what I thought I'd do even myself I said yeah I spent so much money over the Christmas let me get some bits and bobs in, but I don't want to spend too much money. So I've got all this stuff in here, okay? So guys, let's see what he's saying. I can't even remember the stuff that I got, man, because I've been waiting to do the, the video and I don't want to bust the box until I did it with you guys. So bam, let's have a look at this, see what he's saying. Get in, have it. Yo. Bam, that's it man. This is some of the brands that are in here guys, as you can see. Got here um, some brand called Selected. So that's the Selected Harm, Cheap Monday, and a brand called Only Sons. And to be honest with you, it looked really, really cool. So I, I wanna check all of this out and see what it's saying. I think what I'm gonna do for this one guys, is I'm gonna be doing a try on so you see everything on the side so we can get this video done nice and swiftly. Okay, bam, let's see what we've got. Right, first things first. So here, that's the brand I was talking about, man. Selected Home. I really do recommend them because I don't think they're that expensive and um, the quality is really, really good. So let's see. Um, oh, look, I even got some smart trousers, man. So that's really cool. Gonna be trying those on this in a second, see what they're saying. Um, got a little jumper in here. 
Again, another brand called Selected Harm. Um, more Selected Harm stuff. Not quite sure. Looks like they sent me two jumbles. This cheap Monday. I like cheap Monday, man. They do some decent stuff. Got that in. Got this brand here called Only on Sons. I've got this one right here guys, this one only in Sons again, so I'm going to try all of this stuff to see what it said. Even gave me a little sticker as well just to make me feel all blessed, love that. So bam, let's have a look at this in more detail. Okay guys, so let's start off with all these bits and bobs, let's see what all this stuff is saying. Bam. Right, okay, so we've got all this stuff. Let's start with this selected Tom top right here. And I have, as I said, I've never had any selected um, home in before, man. It's the first time that I'm getting this in, so it'd be really good to see what it's saying. I mean, obviously, I bought that top, that top over in Berlin, sorry, in Hamburg, but that was the first time I got it in, and I really like that top that I got. So I thought to myself, let me try and get some more bits and bobs. So let's see what this one's saying. Wow. Okay. So that's it right there, man. Selected harm. Um, I think the brand is Danish and stuff like that. Okay, just looking at this one. First things first, I don't know what was going on, but when I saw this online, it looked cool. But looking at this one, I don't know, man, not really feeling it so far. I'm not really feeling the pattern. Um, I need to try it on and see what it looks like live off. But it seems pretty thin, this one. Seems pretty thin, as you can see there, quite thin. Um, no, not too sure about this one, but I'm going to try it on anyway and let's see. Just want to see what it's made of right here. So this is a, it says it's a medium. Let's see if we can see what the construction is. Okay, that's cool. 100% cotton. That is really good. Really good to see that, man. Because so many brands are mixing with polyester and viscous and all types of plastic, man. But I'm old school. I just prefer if you just make stuff in cotton and wool and leave it as that. But anyway, that's just me. Let's see. So guys, I'm going to be doing a try on the side so you can see what this is saying. Let me know your thoughts. But looking at it live over like this, I don't know if I'm feeling it anymore, man. I, I'm not quite sure. I don't usually go for these types of patterns like that, but it looks a little bit thin as well. But anyway, I'm doing a try on the side. You can see what that looks like. Let me know your thoughts on that one. Bow. That's that one. Let's have a look at this one. Again, this one is Cheap Monday. It says right there that the brand is from Stockholm. Do you know what? This looks nice. I like this, man. I like the look of this. It looks really cool. Very, very nice. Let's see. And it feels nice as well. It feels really soft. Um, size medium. Let's just hope this is made from 100% cotton. I hope it is. Oh no, it's 100% acrylic. Oh, man, plastic. Anyway. I think stuff like this tends to bubble really easily, man, which is why I'm not really feeling acrylic too tough. I'm a bit disappointed that that was, um, that this is 100% acrylic. But anyway, I'm gonna try it on anyway, because I like the look of it. Let me not judge it too quick. Let me see what that's saying in some full detail. Let's have a look at the back. I must say that it does feel really nice, man. It does feel really nice. The only thing with these type of thicker, um, chunky knit tops, which is what I, I really like chunky knit tops, but the only thing like this one is they pull very easily. So if you're walking past that and you can easily just get this caught on something and it pulls, you can pull it on something and that can be really annoying. But um, anyway, let's see what this looks like on the side. Let's see what it's saying, okay? Bam, that's that one. Only sons. I must admit, man, this stuff looks better on the site than it does here, but I shouldn't judge too quick. Let me let me pull it out and see properly what it's saying. Okay. So this one, Only Sun. I really like the look at this brand, man. They have lots of cool stuff. Looking at this one, almost looks like a bit of a Christmas jumper, this one. Let's have a look. Only Suns, let's see. Looks okay, looks like a bit of a Christmas jumper, man. Not really too sure about this one. This one is 40 quid. I mean, for 40 quid, you can't really go wrong, man. Got the little Only and Sons kind of logo down there. Someone's calling me. Gonna have to call them back in a second. Um, just wanna see what the material is made from. Let's have a look. Here we go. So, Only Sons. 
made in China. What are you made of? Okay, can't see the material there. Here we go, maximum shrinkage. So they're saying this top could shrink by 5%. I can't even see what it's made of. Fabric. That's a bit lame. Don't know what it's made of because it doesn't say. Doesn't say on there, man. Anyway, let me just, let me try that on again on the side, guys. Let's see what that's saying. Let's see if it looks any good on. And I would really appreciate you lots of feedback, man. Leave me some feedback below. Let me know what you think, okay? That's that one. Two seconds, we'll try that on. Right, really like the look of this one because it looks nice, thick and chunky. And as you guys know, I love my chunky knits. So let's have a look. Here we go. Yeah, I've got a jumper like this already, man. I'm gonna actually, let me just, so, can't see if I just can't bring it out. Bam, special guest appearance, man. This one right here, one of my favorite tops, this one is by YMC, as you can see right there. Bam, YMC, really, really love this top, guys. One of my favorites. I was trying to show you this about, about this one just before the Christmas, man, and yeah, it's such a cool brand. Even got the bloody dry cleaning thing. I haven't even taken that off yet. Let's take that off real quick. Yeah, love this man. This should be a hundred percent. Um, yeah, hundred percent lambs with that one. But this one's expensive. It costs like a hundred and twenty, a hundred and forty. I bought one in grey and I bought one in blue. Every um, Christmas, I usually go down to YMC and I usually buy some bits. But I didn't do that this year. I didn't do that. Um, was just too busy running around and doing bits and bobs. But yeah, man, do check out YMC, guys. Really, really cool. Been showing a lot of people about that brand. But yeah, this reminded me of it, so that's why I got it in, because it looks kind of similar. And I love the way that the knit stitching is different from the arm as well. And I even like the way that they've done um, color on this one. This one looks really cool, actually. I like the look at this. And this one was 40 quid. 40 quid. Can't really go wrong, man. I think that's a good price. Uh, for some of you that are looking not to spend too much cheese, that price could prove to be quite good. Um, ah, what is going on? 100% acrylic. Hmm. Again, I would prefer when things are made from cotton or pre pre made from um, wool. But anyway, man, again, I'm not gonna knock it. 40 quid, you can't really go wrong. I'm gonna try it on. I'm gonna see what it's saying in two seconds. But yeah, you'll see that one on the side, guys. Let me know what you think on that one. Um, last two we got in. Really like the looks of these ones, man. It's like a jersey type um, top. And it's got the uh, pockets on the side. I just really like the look of that. I just thought it was really cool. Um, this was, how much was this? This was 35. Again, this is from Selected Home. Yeah, just like the look of it, man. Really like this kind of pouch thing here at the bottom. I just thought this would be a nice little kind of casual run around top for a dress down day. So yeah, that one's nice. Just want to see if I can find out what it's made from. 100% cotton, that's what I want to see man, I want to see stuff like that, 100% cotton, so that's really good. Really like the look at these ones, um, depending on how this fits, I could end up keeping that one, that looks really nice, but yeah, looking at the back, yeah it looks all blessed man, 40 quid, can't really go wrong, again that was from a brand called Selected Home, um, and I've got the same thing again, you know what I'm like guys, I buy something and I buy 10 of the same things in, in different colours man, so I've got the same thing basically a different colour. So let's just have a look real quick. I'm trying to open this really gently. Bam. There we go. That's it. Yeah. Da, I like that man. That's nice. I like this little run around top. Different colour there. It was really cool. So again guys as you can see it's the same um, same top, different colour. Again I'm gonna be trying this on the side and let you know, let me know what you guys think, okay? So guys, that's it, man. That's all the stuff from um, from the Idol Man. Again, for some of you guys that are looking for some cheaper bits, you don't wanna spend too much money, bam, jump over to Idol Man, man. Check out their website. You never know, you might see some stuff from there, okay? Um, what else? I've still got to review some AMI jumpers that I got in. I got a Vivian Westwood jumper. That was all the stuff that I got from a place called Coggles, who I really do recommend. They're really, really cool. Um, what else have I got coming? I've got loads of other stuff coming, guys. Lots of stuff going on behind the scenes. I'm not going to reveal too much yet, but I've got lots of really cool stuff coming. But anyway, if you want to follow me on the um, Street Tours Amsterdam, 
all you got to do guys is just um, follow me on the old Snapchat. I'll put the link below. I'll be putting all the videos and clips up on Snapchat and I'll also be putting out um, stuff on the Instagram as well. Okay, so guys, that's it, man. I hope you enjoyed those um, items that I got in. Um, I'll be doing more of those as well. I will be doing more items which are a little bit cheaper for some of you guys that are looking for more cheaper bits and bobs, okay? So that's that. Send all your questions through to me, guys. Shout me on Snapchat, Instagram, or leave your comments on the comments box below. And guys, sorry that I've been taking so long to reply to you on the YouTube, man. It's been a, it's been so much to try and keep up with all the um, messages. But when I go to Amsterdam and I chill out for a little bit, I'll find a nice little quiet spot, maybe in a coffee shop or something, and I'll catch up to all of you on the YouTube, okay? So that's that. Guys, have a good evening. Catch you lot in a bit, okay? Peace out.